and we're hoping to get on some brook trout in one of these back lakes. I locked my keys in the car. Giant walleye. We put to get some birds. We're gonna take some chance. I got Doyle behind the camera. He's gonna be shooting this for me. Get it, Maggie! Get What is going on folks? TCG back at it again with another video. It is a kind of chilly morning, but it's supposed to warm up to about minus one, so it shouldn't be bad. I'm going to a little back lake in Renfrew County with uh, Doyle from Eastern Ontario Adventure. I got Maggie here. Uh, we have another buddy who might be coming, uh, but we're gonna be packing light, no hut, and we're just bringing augers, fishing rods, and bait. And we're hoping to get on some brook trout in one of these back lakes. Been to this lake before and it was just a fantastic time. Tons of fish were caught. So we're hoping to do the same thing today. So the first stop of the video has got to be at Tim Hortons because it's uh, 5.42 in the morning. I need some coffee. I need uh, some food and some timbits for later for me and the dog. And then after that, we got to get some bait in Renfrew, which we're going to go to Gurley's Variety and Gaspar. Uh, they open at 7 a.m., which is just in time to uh, get after these fish. Hey, could I get a large regular? And I'll get a 20 pack of assorted timbits. No, that's it. Thank you. I decided since I'm not the biggest fan of Tim Hortons breakfast these days, had it way too many times, I'm going to opt for some McDonald's breakfast, get a breakfast bagel from there, and then get on with the day. Now that I got my food, let's get on with this fishing experience. Got about an hour drive to the bait shop, and then uh, it's off to the lake, so let's go. All right, folks, so quick change of plans. I just stopped at the Timmy's in Renfrew. I'm meeting Doyle here. He's gonna toss me a walkie-talkie because uh, we don't have service out where we're going. Uh, so it's better to have walkie-talkies to communicate if something happens. Chances are we'll be fishing together, but uh, might as well be safe than sorry. So we're just gonna get these walkie-talkies. He's getting something to eat here, and then we're off to the bait shop. And then we're going after these fish. Stay tuned. Is there even a point to play roll up the rim anymore? All you get is play agains. I've had like 40 or 50 coffees this season and only one has won. This is freaking ridiculous. Timmy's, get your shit together, man. Look who it is. We got Eastern Ontario Adventures in the flesh. He's hitting his gas while he's parked. And you know, we're getting, uh, we're getting these walkies going. Should we just wait till we get there? Give me that shit. Hey, so that's what we came here for. The walkie talkie. Thanks bro. Test one, two, one, two. Yo, yo, testing, testing, is it working? Over. Sure is, buddy. Over and out. Your destination is on the right. So we forgot minnows. Where so we, we at? made a pit stop to get minnows. I don't know where we are. Something outdoors? Gurley's bait shop. Hurley's? Gurley's. my keys in the car so we just got our bait and we're supposed to go fishing now but Doyle locked his keys in his freaking car so we don't really know what to do the bait shops looking for a metal coat hanger and we're gonna try to break into this thing got the uh, extended minnow net give that a try I don't know how far down to go though and I don't 
don't know how uh, how I'm gonna get this done. Look at you go! Come on, Joel, you can do it, man. I don't know how far to go, but I think this piece is too short. Only Doyle locks his keys in the car. Hey, Doyle? That's not true. Lots of people do it. Oh! Oh, fuck, yeah! Let's go. Oh! <laughs> Let's go. Let's Woo! go. All right. Let's go fishing, dude. Get that door open. Don't close that dang door. Mm -hmm. Oh my God, dude. <laughs> Doyle, yes. So Doyle finally got his door open. It took him a while, but he got it done using coat hangers and uh, minnow, uh, minnow scoop. So uh, we're just gonna head to the lake now and get on these fish. All right, folks, so we just got to the lake. We found the spot we want to fish. Doyle shoveled out a section. I'm gonna shovel out my section now, and then we're gonna drill some holes and get a line in the water. I only got another two and a half to three hours of fishing, so we gotta make this happen quick, get on some fish, and uh, hopefully we can get a good video out of this. All right, so I extended my auger all the way up because this ice is gonna be probably at least two feet thick, maybe more. So uh, let's get after dr this drilling this hole. Okay, so my hole is set. I got my deeper Pro Plus fish finder here, and I'm gonna be using that to locate these fish, help me catch them. I'm gonna drop it down right now. There she goes, get my portable battery plugged to my iPad. Maggie, why don't you go sit with Ryan? That's a huge chicken wrap. Yeah, I know. Maggie, it's you're huge. knocking snow into the hole. I'm gonna need to scoop mine again. So I'm in 12.2 feet here. I'm just gonna mess around and put a jig and wrap down just for shit, see what happens. Well, folks, we're all rigged up. We're finally fishing, no longer messing around. Got my minnow dead sticked right now. Uh, and we're just gonna wait it out and see if we can get on some, uh, some brook trout. All right, so we're about an hour in. We haven't really had much luck. Uh, we marked a couple of fish, we were in 12 feet. And uh, uh, I thought I had a bite, Doyle thought he had a bite, but nothing serious. So I moved out deeper, I'm now in 20 feet of water. Doyle went to 15, then he went back to 12, uh, or, or whatever it is where I'll he is tell, now. I'll tell you right now what it is. He's gonna tell me right now. But anyways, um, we, we don't know too much about trout fishing, at least I don't through the ice. Uh, so I have a dead stick in 12 with a minnow and then I'm jigging in uh, 20 with a minnow. Uh, I don't know if the fish are deeper, shallower, uh, I assume I, I did some research and I saw that they do go a bit shallower this time of year, but I'm not or a bit deeper, sorry. But maybe that was just someone saying it who didn't know either. I don't know. So leave a comment below if you know anything about trout fishing this time of year. It's early March. Uh, maybe they're deeper, maybe they're shallower, maybe we're in the right spots. I don't know. Uh, let us know and uh, let us know if, if we would use something different like a spinner, spoon, uh, soft plastic, something like that. But right now we're just jigging minnows, trying to get fish on the board here. Well, folks, we're giving up on the brookies. We tried our best, we gave it an hour and a half. I only got 45 minutes left of fishing. So we're gonna move to another lake. Uh, it's right over this hill behind me and we're gonna give a shot for some rainbow trout. We'll see what happens. Let's get over there. Almost lost the donuts on that one. I just want to see your big tube jig go down. That's... <laughs> be nice. You think the rainbows in here would eat that? Oh, well, pretty big rainbow. <laughs> That's why we're trying it. You never know. If I do, I'm gonna scream like a little girl.
All right, so as you can see, I am no longer on the ice. It was a little slow this morning, but it was still fun to get out there. Now we are out here at our buddy's property. We got TCG merch here, and we're gonna do a shoot for some photos for the uh, social media. So I think I'm just gonna film behind the scenes of it. Also take some photos as well, so uh, let's get right to it. Yeah, it's Jay Goods out here at the photo shoot. Brought the sled, bought the rig, got the merch, we got Tori, we got Chad. Just a day-to-day -day life. Welcome to the lifestyle. Sweet. Yeah, I don't need any clothes. I've got this too. We got turkey prints, boys. This spring, we killing ya. Yo, what up? Cap Studios here. Just had a sick shoot with TCG out in the boonies. Always a good time. Uh, it turned out super dope, so uh, stay tuned for the content. Well, folks, we are officially done with the photo shoot. Even though this day started off kind of iffy with the whole Doyle locking his keys in his car, causing us to get to the lake a little late. I locked my keys in the car. And then we got there and the fishing sucked. We had marks, but nothing serious, no bites. Even though that did suck, it was still a great experience getting out there, met some new people and then ending it with the photo shoot, showing you guys the behind the scenes of how a photo shoot looks and having Capitol Studios there and Tori Page there to do the photos. Chad killed it behind the camera, Tori killed it in front of the camera and it was just an overall great time. Uh, we wanted to show you guys the behind the scenes of what a photo shoot looks like when we're doing our merch shots and stuff like that. Uh, so if you enjoyed that, hit the like button, leave a comment below saying, yo, we like this style of video, keep doing them. If you didn't like it, let us know and say, you know, don't post this on the channel again. Stick to whatever. Uh, but we're trying to do new things here, mixing things up a bit. So we want to hear from you guys. Let us know if you liked it, if you didn't like it, and so on and so forth. And if you ain't subscribed to the channel, you got to subscribe because it's Sunday. And we're dropping videos every Sunday. So if you want to keep watching these videos, hit that subscribe button. Hit the notification bell because it'll tell you when we post a video. Thank you all for watching. And we'll catch you in the next video.